Cindy. I know him. That's George. Look, Cindy, come with me now, please. Look, this, this is madness. What are you doing here? I'm not here. This way. Look, Cindy, please. It's fine, Ian. I won't be long, I promise. How do you know we were here? What are you talking about? We live here. I run this place. A Vic? <laughs> you can't. Look, Ralph, Cindy, whatever the hell your name is. I used to live here. What? A long time ago. In Wolfram? When? Many years ago, be before we met. So you're not here to see me and the girls then? I didn't even know you were here. I had no idea. Yeah, well, we always were a second thought, weren't we? You do realise that today is Anna's, Anna's birthday. Anna's birthday? Yes, of course I do. Are they here, George? Are June and Anna here? No. No, Anna. They, they stayed in Spain. I just can't believe this is happening. I... Yeah, me neither. Most of the point, I don't want to. Look, so now we know it's one big freak coincidence. How about you turn around, walk out with that fella out there, sink a bottle, wake up in the morning, no recollection of what happened. How about we agree to that? How are they? How are the girls? Fine. Fine. That's all you're getting. You lost the right to know how the girls are when you walked out the door. What sort of person does that, eh? What part of your brain is missing? I don't know. I don't know. I don't even know how I'm still standing. The, the pain I just feel every single day. Oh, poor Rose. Always the tragic victim. Always that far away look in your eyes, like you're in a silent movie in your head. It was like that. It was just exactly like that. I wanted to share it with you, George. I, I wanted to be honest with you. But... 